Hi there and welcome back. Um, if you saw my video uh, the other day, I was tidying this box out and having a bit of a route around um, and putting things in here because I'm going to start um, some botanical projects and I've printed out the kits that I'm going to use. The kits that I'm going to be using over the next couple of months are at the top of the description. Uh, and I thought, I really ought to use, you know, what I've already got printed out before I start uh, cutting things out. Um, so I'm working my way through this. I'd also got things in here. Um, I think we've done a couple of projects so far um, out of there. So today I've got these. Now these are from Taperology. They was uh, single uh, cards. I've backed them all. They're not thin. Um, Could have got away without backing them. But I don't know, I like thick um, tags. So I've sat, well, part of yesterday and today and backed them all. Some of them I stuck them next to each other and then folded them. So we've got some folding ones. Some of them I put uh, top to top. So we've got some uh, opening ones and lots of them I did single. So I'm just going to work my way uh, through this. I'll do about half an hour uh, on camera and then, you know, I'll finish off off camera because you'll probably be fed up. Um, so what I've got out of that box and, you know, what I've found is uh, these, which I think Deb Hale sent me or she sent me some and then I bought the dye and did some more I can't quite remember so I've got uh, these which are I'm not sure if these are the Tim Holtz ones or if these are um, a different one I think they're the Tim Holtz ones so it's Tim Holtz wildflower uh, dye so in different uh, greens I'll leave that one out because obviously that's uh, started one and then I've got loads of uh, bits out of that tub so this is what I'll be uh, decorating with yep okay so they're just above above my mat I've also got some inks out now I did ink all around them in vintage photo these aren't shiny, they're, they're a gloss, but not a shiny gloss. So the ink, the Tim Holtz ink, kind of, you know, moshes uh, down it. I don't know if moshes is a official uh, word. So I'm going to use the uh, archival inks because they're a more permanent. I've got blackout for... Um, I've got... These stamps, I forget who these are. Are they Emma Parish stamps or? Um, yeah, I forget. I've got two of these sets, so they're they're very Tim Holtzy. Um, they've got signatures and dates and things. So I thought I can use the black uh, for that, and I've got a couple of stays on because I've only got a couple of. Uh, these and a couple of these and I've got uh, olive green and a saddle brown thought the saddle brown would be good for you know this backing one I think this is an AliExpress um, you know cheapo one but great for uh, backgrounds and I've got a couple of stencils out so I've got uh, that one which is a there's a cheap AliExpress one, and so is that. And then I've got two uh, Tim Holtz ones, which love um, joining themselves to each other. So I've got this music one. Oh, my goodness. Oh, come on. And um, this pattern one, which is going to be ruined. Okay, that one. So let's keep those 
away from each other. Okay, so that's that's what I've got out. Um, so we'll just we'll just work through them. So this has got quite a lot um, on the back, so I might not want to put. Um, any stamping at the at the back we'll see I'm feeling like I want to get rid of this one there that would fit wouldn't it if I just um, cut cut the bottom off slightly so let's cut that off I can obviously use that somewhere else and I'll cut across here like so If I take that one off, like so, and then I'm just going to just change that a little bit. Okay, and then I can stick stick that on. Probably need to just take that off. Okay, so that's lovely. So I've got my Cosmic Shimmer. I still can't find my uh, pen. I don't think I've looked for it. I keep saying I can't find it, but um, I, I've not looked for it. So I'm guessing this is going to come out a little brown tinged because obviously this isn't stainless steel. Yeah, yeah. Well, that's fine. I'm not going to see see the glue okay so that's one done oops I need to turn the volume down on my um, computer I was just listening to my daily um, astronomy astrology not astronomy okay let me just turn that down because otherwise every notification I get will get that blub blub sound. Yeah, that's lovely. And then it's opening and then we've got that at the back which you can obviously uh, write on as well. So that's the first one. Let's pop that over there. So we've got this one which is pretty plain. So I think I'll put something in the background of that. But let's decide what we're going to put put on that. So I've got some little um, squares. Saw a lovely uh, video what Denise um, did. I wonder if I've got them in three sizes. I could just, why I'm... If you've not seen it, okay, that's the same one. Okay, need one a bit smaller, really. Got that one. It's a bit wonky, way. That one. Oh, why am I not the same size? Okay. Right, so I'll do it with that one, that one, and that one. So she got three images, like uh, like so. Let's just give them a bit of an ink, ink around. I thought it was ingenious. Um, I don't know if she saw it on somebody else's or if if she just came came up with that, but. A great way to use um, these smaller uh, bits bits up so I like that and then we'll turn them over and kind of central them up like so let me just get my um, some scrappy bits we'll cut Three of these off one. Well, I'm going to cut four off. Um, one, two, three, four. Okay, I'm going to want the 
Fabric Tack. Just open it out and I can't see if that's coming out or not. No, I don't think it has. If it's not gunking out, then I can't see. See it? Okay. So we'll put that there and join those two together. I don't know if there's enough glue on there. Okay, and then I think I, think I want it a bit smaller. I'll do the same here. I think fabric tacks all or nothing, isn't it? I mean, I do need it in a small bottle, but um, you know, the times I've bought small bottles and they've gunked all up, and I've kind of give up on on that. <sighs> Okay, yep. Okay, let me just put a bit more on here. Ooh. Okay, and then I was going to put a bit at, at the top, I think. And have it hanging, ha hanging over. <laughs> um, so that will be how I attach it to the page. Okay, so I'd attach it there, and then she folded them up like so. And I suppose you could put. Um, a pin on it and not a pin whatever these are called I forget like so and then you turn like that and then you've got those little bits to, to write on just thought it was a really good um, idea for, for these little bits that, that we end up with and if you thought about it I suppose you could that second one you could do that the right direction so your picture was on that side and it was the right, you know, the correct uh, way. Hmm, yeah, that's a good idea. I've not got another three in, in different sizes, but... So, that's that. Um, I'm going to put that in with my ephemera. Okay, let's get back to, to what we was doing. So, I don't think any of those are, are small enough for... On here, neither is that ticket, probably is. So, I'm going to put those back in. Oh, mind you, this um, that bigger size there. So, actually, they are okay size for the bigger. Yeah, these do come in two different sizes. Um, I can't remember if I said they're from Tapeology or not. I do have a coupon code which is down, down below. Um, what else was I going to say? I think that's it. Yes, I've seen them in different colours. I think I've had them in blue. I think I've seen them in pastels. Um, and yeah, that's about it. Okay, let's, um, let's have a look what we've... Again, they're probably too too big. These are going to be totally too big for, for this project. I'm going to put those over there because I've got some bigger things another time. Oh, that's a, a, a rub-on. Again, these are from, uh, oh, is it? No, it's not. It's an actual, okay, it's an actual sticker. Right, so what I'm going to do is, because it's that washy um, stuff, you'll see, you know, underneath it. So if I st stamp behind, like so... And, and just place, I'm going to place it in the green. That's it. Let me just 
It's gonna go out there. That's it. Oh my goodness, how quick was that? <laughs> so that's that one. Okay. Lovely. That's two two down. Caught up a little bit because obviously I got waylaid with um with the other one. So this is another one that uh flips up. Love that background. Could do with a nice oh yeah, I like that. They're gonna to be too big for that. So is those. Just thinking I could do with something just a little bit more tiny. Ooh. Oh, I like that. Let's do do the same thing, but I think I want to do the background in uh, brown. Oh, crikey, that is brown. Saddle brown. Okay, have I got any left on it? That's it. So these are those little uh, dye things. Tie things. I bought these off uh, eBay last last year. Okay, that's another one. On this one, I suppose I could grab one of those stamps. Have I got a? Oh, have some stunts on there. Let's get rid of those and use the use the archival. I've got it on the right way. I can't see. Let's let's just hope for the best. Okay. Oh, I love these. Really uh, easy. Obviously, you don't need um, these these backgrounds. You can do them, you know, with scrapbook paper or um, digitals or whatever. These are uh, from one of my digitals, and I've printed them on vellum. That's another one. Oh, that's nice. So shall we just shall I stencil this one for a change? Let's do it. Yep, we'll do it with the green. I've not got a lot of room, which is obviously you know why things keep going oops and oopsie these. Come on. Oh, lovely. Yeah, I've kind of got to, you know, put things back where, where they belong. Otherwise, um, I just get drowned in stuff. So, I'll put that on. And then I'll probably use one of those stumps again. So, it's sample. I don't know if I said that last time. Um, who those stumps are. Stumps are off. I think I'd seen them on Instagram um, and then I searched searched them online. I think sample, I think that term um, rings rings about. Um let's get, oh, the date one. I'll say what I was looking for was uh, some signatures. That's um what made me uh, want these stamps and I still haven't done the project what, what I wanted it for probably do it in this botanical series oh lovely <coughs> excuse me I have still got my cold and I'm just wanting to prove that I've still got it okay that's it that's another one that's a single uh, one I obviously don't have to use these as tags I could glue them down two sides and they could be little uh tucks can obviously put um little hinges on and things and and make them interactive little pieces so you know i've not got a billion uh tags there can be all kinds of things this is also from my uh botanical fussy cut 
I think I'm going to leave that um, plain. I like that. Stick that on. I think I'll do one of the um, stamps, but um, I don't think I want anything at the background. There it says like figure 17 and there's a date on there. So I quite like that one, even though I've covered both of those things up. Okay. Uh, I don't want that one. Let's have a look at the other set. They're quite big actually for, for small, small things. I'll just get this, this number. Okay, and pop that down. Done that. Lovely. I could obviously put a hole in them if I wanted and, and have, um, you know, but um, for now I won't because, like I said, I don't know. I don't know how I'm going to be, be using them like that and that fills that space up lovely. So, yeah, lots of random stuff out of, out of this box. I thought it's absolutely crazy cutting new kits up when, you know, I've still got stuff from last year. And I bet some of this stuff's even from, you know, the year the year before. Um, I'll use this number again. And I'm going to go across there. Like so. Okay. Lovely. Oh, such... Such simple crafting. I think this video goes up on a Sunday, so this is an ideal uh, Sunday Sunday craft. So this is a sticker that's got an awful lot of white around, so I'm just going to cut it down slightly. So yes, after I've finished videoing, I'm going to continue to finish these off and use as much of these bits as as I can and then I'd pulled some other things out at the side which also need backing so I will get those done and then I'll be prepped for um the next the next video for for next week I will be away soon um I think I'm nearly two weeks in front with videoing. So today it is about two and a half weeks till till I go away. I'll mention it now, but I will be doing a video about it. Um, I am, well, currently going through um, a separation. It, I have been separated since um, just after Christmas and um it's it's getting to the to the point because it's still still hit you know living here um but um it'll be moving out very soon and i've had to cancel a lot of things um you know what what i pay for uh bill wise so um Oh, I've cancelled loads of stuff, you know, and I think, I think you forget these things what you're actually paying for. So, I've cancelled Prime, Amazon Prime, um, my health insurance, um, my, um, I used to pay monthly for prescriptions, so if I needed a prescription, I didn't have to pay for them. Um, I don't know, and other little things. Um, so all I'm left with is, you know, your, your gas, electric, water, um, TV license, and what else do we pay? Oh, council tax. Um, and I've cancelled the, um, oh, and mobile phones, but I've cancelled the, what have I cancelled? 
we'll pop that on there it's just a sticker um the the tv you know your your sky um i didn't have sky i had virgin um so i've cancelled the tv the internet and the house um phone landline so when i come back from my holiday um i will come back lovely and i won't have any any internet um so i may go missing uh for a while um because i don't know how i'm going to uh financially stand um until i mean you know i'm not saying i totally don't know how i'm gonna stand because that'd just be crazy but um yeah i don't totally know how i'm gonna be be um until you know is gone and i'm i'm paying out the bills that um you know the necessity uh bills i'm not sure how much maintenance is going to be giving me if if at all um things are quite fraught um yeah so i may go missing that is the whole the whole point of of me saying this so i'm going to be getting as front you know as i can it's a little bit boring that isn't it it's very pale um hmm i don't know it's a double one so i don't really want to I don't know how I feel about that. I quite like it actually. Um, yeah, so if I, if I go go missing, um, you know, don't don't worry. Um, I'm in the middle of um, getting together a little design team, so um, there'll be other people, not just uh, Denise, uh, using my kits because. I don't think I'm going to be able to, I don't know, fit, you know, fit them in um, while I've got no internet and things. So, um, yeah, I think that's it. I don't want to, because uh, like I say, I'm, I'm going to do do a video about it before before I go go away. So, um, I don't even know what got me, got me on that Um conversation to be honest right oh well I've got that side this is one of the mason jars I can't remember what kit it's out of I don't know if it's what one of mine but I don't know if I don't know if it was a freebie or or if it was in one of the one of the kits I can't remember what have we got on here let's we'll just stick with the with the same one it just makes it makes it easier shall we go let's go up the top oh i might have just squashed that oh not too bad okay okay that's that one hey going through these my piles going down ish don't look that much different but hey ho right oh I think that needs going on something with a bit more uh background so leaf there i'm going to put that over that right oh some more of the vellum pieces nice so let me let's do some more stenciling i keep forgetting i've got the stencils out um shall we do the brown again it was a bit brown brown wasn't it but I suppose it's summer, so I don't want um, dark, you know, chocolatey, chocolatey brown. Ooh, that's, that's better. Okay, okay. All right, let's pop this in. Again, that's one of, one of the ones in Vallum. Denise has been doing quite a lot of different things with, with Vallum. Um, I've not printed anything on vellum for for ages. I think all I've been printing really is is the new kits, you know, to do the the flip throughs of. Um, I've not really been doing any extra 
um, printing. Because like I say, I seem to have tub after tub of leftover. I'm looking for something that to put there. I'm going to put an actual uh, label. This is from uh, one of my kits. I feel like it might be Foxglove Forest, but I'm not too sure. Um, yeah, so I've done no, like, extra uh, printing. Oh, that's curling. Let's put a bit more on that edge. Okay. Yeah, and I think if I do put some whole reinforcements or something, um, these plainer ones, it'll obviously jolly them up. Look how many we've done. Brilliant. Fabulous. Okay. What time are we on? Oh, let's do a couple more. Got a couple more of the small ones, and then I'll do the bigger ones off camera. Um, I'm only using, you know, what I've got on here. I've got all these vellums, but because they are together, I'd rather save them and and use the the single the single bits. I like I like that, and I'm actually going to leave that playing. It's funny how some things look nice, plain, and they don't look boring. Yeah, other things you think, oh, cracky, that's plain, and it looks boring. Whereas that, I think that's just the right, the right thing. Could probably do with a little label. Let's. I'm not sure I've pulled some little labels out. Because all I'm going to do now is just keep pulling. I'm, I'm at the side. Oh. I was going to say, all I'm going to do is keep pulling small ones out, but uh, big ones, but I've just pulled, pulled that small one out. I think this is a Tracy Fox uh, one. A collected by Super. That's that one. <sighs> this one. Oh. No, I think it's too too swirly, that. No, not with that. That's a wide one. That's not going to fit on on any of them. I'm going to put that back in my tub. Oh, oh, that's cute. I wonder. I could do with one going. I've got another ticket apart from that one I don't know why I'm holding it like it's it's gonna run off oh look at this one oh that'll be better for the for the bigger ones um I saw something a second ago not that this um ticket what I'm gonna do is not with those scissors. Just going to cut around here. Most of my tickets are from uh, Taperology or your creative studio boxes. The ones that aren't digitals. Okay. Oh, I think I'm ready for, for a drink. I think I've done a lot of talking. I feel... A little bit dehydrated. Oh, I don't know. I've gone right off that now. Um, on these, I think it's because we've got the, you know, the diamond bit there. And then this shape here. Oh, that's nice on there. Let's pop that on, on there. Trying to get it right round the edge so it doesn't curl Ooh. should be able to stamp over that as well shouldn't I with um let's do it 
Let's try this archival. I think it'll be fine. I'll just have to probably leave it to, to dry. Ooh, still curling. Okay. Okay, that's that one. That's the opening one. Um, I backed it all with um, scrappy bits. I've gone around, you know, my tubs and stuff and uh, got things out to use up to back things. Um, ooh, that's nice on there. Let's pop that on. And then we'll call it, we'll call it a video. And thank you very much for uh, joining me. Don't forget to uh, like and uh, leave me a comment. It definitely does help, um, you know, the YouTube algorithm. So that's, that's that. So we've got a good, a good wedge of them. I'm going to do a couple of the tall ones with, with those because I really like those. Okay, I'm great for, for moustache because I've got no botanical uh, stash. Okay, so thank you so much and um, I will see you, see you in the next video. Um, yeah, as I come across little bits, I'm definitely gonna gonna do this. Absolutely ingenious, uh, Denise. Thank you for for sharing that with us. Um, when I know who's um, gonna be helping me out, um, you know, showing my digitals why why I'm not here, um, I shall obviously uh, let you know and put their uh, links in my description too. Okay. Thank you very much um, and I will see you, if this goes up on Sunday, I will be back uh, Thursday. No, no, I do pop a video up tomorrow, don't I? Anyway, I'm going. <laughs> Bye for now.